Hey, what's up guys? Uh, how's it going? As you know, 1.4 came out and along with that team mod loader got moved to Steam. I made a installation video on 1.3.5. So uploading it with 1.4 is a little different. It's pretty self-explanatory, but I'm just going to walk you through, through the steps. It's uh, pretty quick and painless. So the first thing that you'd uh, want to do is just open up Steam since it is on Steam now. Um, you can just search team mod loader right in there. As you see, it'll pop up. It's pretty quick. I already have it installed, but you'll just go down to free install now, and then it'll just install. It takes, it took about a minute and a half for me. And then once that happens, it'll actually be in your library as like a separate game. So once you have it, it's right there, right under Terraria, it says team mod loader, and then you're just going to load it up. Um, it's launching. Um, and that's pretty much it. I'm pretty, I haven't, I haven't opened it yet. Um, but as you can see, even the short sword, uh, mod switched icons. I didn't even see that until right now. Up oh, there it goes and it's open. So, um, looks a little different actually. Um, new, uh, little logo there, but it is, um, it saved my mods from prior. So I do have all my mods. It seems like that's pretty cool. Um, looks exactly the same as before. Let me see if it has all my worlds, has my characters, has my worlds. You know, we're good to go. So that's pretty cool. Um, and that's pretty much it. So you just download from Steam and just open it up like it's its own game. Uh, pretty, fairly more simple than having to drag and drop all the files. So that's pretty cool. Um, so that's about it.